Welcome to Unity Sports Festival 2015 Dubai. I'm here with three very important people and I'll one by one introduce them to you. First we have Brother Abbas Abdulaziz who's been helping with catering. Then we have Brother Fazli Abbas Khan, who's the head of catering. And finally we have Brother Hussain Fazl who's head of volunteering. These guys have been here every morning from 7 till midnight or past midnight, ensuring everyone is satisfied. I'll first question Brother Abbas Abdulaziz and we'll take it on from there. Brother Abbas, what you guys have been doing is phenomenal and uh, I guess a few weeks ago you came on board and the plans were made and your meetings. How has it been so far for you? I think it's been amazing. I would really appreciate uh, that uh, we have so many people from different countries that have come here. We are able to help them and give them the, um, you know, the food, whatever that is, that we can help them. So that's really amazing. But how has the atmosphere been all for you? Prep, preparation-wise, I mean, from morning, everything. I think Fazle Buzz has done a really great job of that. He's organized himself really well. The food has been uh, laid out, you know, four to five days. Everything has been set really well. And then we're adjusting as uh, every day goes by. We're trying to figure out which is the best way to give them food. So Fazle has done a fantastic job, and we're just following those, uh, uh, you know, the, the preparation that he's done. Thank you. I'm here next with the head of catering, Brother Fazli Abbas, who's not only been a stalwart to the mosque and the kitchen of the mosque, but whose voice is so loud that even if you're 50 yards away, you'll hear him shouting you. And if you're not there, boy, boy, oh boy, you're going to regret. Brother Fazli. What an introduction, huh? <laughs> Brother Fazli has been announced head of catering a few months ago and something you always love doing as far as we've known you, serving people food, hospitality, something you're very fond of. How has this whole journey been for you? It's been an amazing experience. I mean, it's the first time experience for me, for myself, to have a catering unit, and that also for the amount of people that we have had. I've always been serving under the kitchen head at the mosque, but not at this level. But on the other hand, the credit goes not only to myself, it goes to Abbas, his name, and also the others down there. It's not only me. This is not possible, just one man. Very truly said. And I know many of you boys are behind the scene who are not here, but whose job has been tremendous to you. And uh, the, the fact that you snap your finger, they come so fast. I mean, many people wish that service could be for them in other general stuff. How have you managed to do that with them? Well, it's not that I've managed to do it with them. It's just I'm lucky with people like that. They understand that things need, need to be done and they need to be done right away. There are no questions asked. I've got that support from them. First time, my final question to you is, everyone has been enjoying your food. It's been beautiful. But, honey, everyone's tired. Rice, curry, rice, curry. We want, when is Fazle going to give us the barbecue, the nyama choma, the mushkaki, the pili pili chips, you know, the amli, the stuff that we look forward to, to these festivals. When are you going to surprise us with that, something phenomenal with that dessert that people would keep on eating and saying, ah, kash mari bairi ayi vitna banai wa hato bana. When is that happening, Fazle? Maybe in the closing, sir, inshallah. Maybe in the closing, sir. Thank you. And man. also, I would like to also note that Brother Munil Walji at the kitchen, he's been of tremendous help as well, cooking for both meals. All right. I, I should not forget him. His, his support with the tea every one, two hours being delivered at the mosque here, and anything else that we require, the constant support from the Jamaat is amazing. Thank, Thank you. you. We'll come to our final interview of the night, Brother Hussain Fazl. Brother Hussain Fazl has been head of volunteering. And it's not the first time he's done this. He's been, as firstly, a part of the kitchen and quality in all aspects. Brother Stan, how has this journey been for you so far? It's been quite interesting. Uh, it's a real big challenge to get everybody to give their commitments. Volunteering is difficult for everyone because there are a lot of players. But they came on board and, um, yeah, there's always a little bit up and down, you know. But yes, we've been managing and we've had so much help from people who are not even... Uh, Boston Joy are leaving in 10 minutes. Uh, we're not even part of our team and uh, they, they came on board and uh, they helped us out. A lot of people, a lot of players. Brother Stain, as far as I know you and many people know you, and not in a bad way, but you like being a perfectionist with many of your things. You always see the small dots, but make sure it's correction. How has it been with the volunteering to make sure it's been a joyful 
ride all the way through. It's been great. It's been great. A lot of support, a lot of help from the volunteers. Uh, it's amazing. It's, it's nice. My final question to you is on the night. For some reason on your WhatsApp, your name comes up as Hasnain Daytona Fazal. Is it a love you have for Daytona car racing or is it just a general thing that this name Daytona has come up or is it something that's attached to you for a very long time? Daytona actually is, uh, is my company name. So are they into car racing? No, no. no. <laughs> We're into cleaning and janitorial supplies. So yeah, Daytona is a company name and that's how I think about it. So it's fine. Brother Fazle, we have one question from everyone. Where is Team Tanga? <laughs> They'll be playing next uh, the next the next festival in South. Some of those are in Dar team. Ah yeah, they're in Dar team. They're in Tanga team. They're in Toronto team. Yeah. yeah, a lot of them have moved out, you know. And being a happy night to you tonight, the Liverpool won one nil. How is it? How does? The, how do you end the night? You know, right now I've got no time to celebrate or have or have any sort of uh, enjoy any. I don't have luxury of time to enjoy moments like that. Probably after the festival, we'll probably I'll watch the game again and then see how it went. No problem. This is Brother Jawad Askar with Brother Abbas Abdulaziz, Brother Fazle Abbas Kaku, and Brother Hasnain Fazal signing out of Unity Sports Festival 2015. Dubai away!